Hey guys, it's Joanne. I am recording this from my iPad because I wanted to make a quick video to announce some great news um, from a couple weeks ago, but I haven't had a chance to record a video in a while. Oh, I'm out of breath because I ran up the stairs to hide from my kids. Anyway, um, I was asked um, to join the design team at Cat Scrappiness. Hi, Cat. Her YouTube channel is The Cat's Meow 1969, I think it is. Um, I'm gonna try to remember to put it in the description box down below. I don't know how to do that when I'm uploading from my iPad, but anyway, she opened up an Etsy shop recently. It is at catscrappiness.com. You can see that right there. And um, she's got some awesome and adorable felt, little felty embellishments. Super cute. And um, she asked me to play along with her design team for the next few months. So I wanted to share a couple projects with you before Christmas starts in a couple days. And I wanted to make sure I squeeze these in. But they'll probably be in my... Um, on my blog in a couple of days. Oh my gosh, somebody just rang my doorbell. Wait, hold on. Oh, it's UPS. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> anyway, um, so for the first design team package I um, received, I received a, a couple of stuff. She was kind enough to just say or ask us what we um, wanted in her shop and then and whatever. So I didn't have a preference, but I did like these cute little ornaments. And I used a couple of them already. So, and they come pa packaged pretty nicely with her little logo here and her website. That's very clever. And then it was folded down and super cute. It's packaged on craft paper, nice and sturdy. And then I got these little holly leaves, some cute little reindeer, some adorable penguins. These are pretty big. If you can see my hand, they're pretty big. So these, the big ones I'll probably use on scrapbooking layouts when I get a chance, but I haven't scrapbooked in a while. And these, this cute bell, and this set of gingerbread men. There were two, but I used the second one. So I'll show you the cards that I made. Um, I made three cards. The first one is um, using the gingerbread man, like I said, and I used some designer paper from Basic Gray, some twine that I picked up from, or actually... It's kind of weird. This twine, it, not, I don't know what it calls, but, like, it frays, I guess. When, once I cut it, it, like, unraveled, if you could see that. So, it's from ribboncarousel.com. And um, this sentiment is from K. Andrew Design. Actually, all of them are from K. Andrew. Hold on, let me reach. Sorry to make you busy. Where did I put it? Hold on. Oh, darn it. Okay, I can't find it right now. So anyway, <laughs> I used um, all my sentiments for my Christmas cards recently have been from K. Andrew Design. So this one is from Winter Wishes Set. And it was two stamps, and I ended up stamping them close together and rounding off the corners of that. So that's my first card. My second card is using the cute little ornaments. And this is another Winter Wishes Set from K. Andrew Designs. So this Winter Wishes... No, this... <laughs> ornament set. Sorry, I'm trying to rush. Um, I hung with twine. More twine. This one's from Whisker Graphics. More paper from Basic Gray. And then this cardstock is from Paper Tray Ink. Super simple and easy, but I wanted to squeeze in a couple more Christmas cards before um, Christmas season is over. And then this cute one is with the holly. More ribbon from Ribbon Carousel. And another sentiment from the Winter Wishes set from K. Andrew Designs. So, um, I thought this would be super cute with this background paper. If you could see. Gosh, holding this iPad is not easy, I'm telling you. But yeah, so three layers of um, holly leaves and little cute little berries. So I think it adds a lot of dimension. These felties are super cute. So, anyway, I want to thank Kat for asking me to join and play along for the next few months. I've got some great ideas using all this stuff and hope to show you some more again soon. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching today. Bye.